What if I told you that mathematics can explain music? To understand this, we have to go back 2,500 years to a great mathematician called Pythagoras. He asked to himself, why some sounds create pleasant harmony and some others unpleasant noise? Is there maybe some mathematical connection that explains this? The reason why some sounds make beautiful music is mathematics. More precisely, the relationships of the instruments making the music. So if the string of a harp is exactly half the length of another, or two-thirds, whole number ratios, they will produce nice music, otherwise they won't. Pythagoras was fascinated at how mathematics has the power to explain the nature around us, and this was the first time that he actually showed this to be true. Mathematics could explain music, two fields which seemed unrelated. Can't it maybe explain also other natural phenomena? Pythagoras took the ideas of harmony and music also to the movement of planets. Since planets also moved in mathematical ratios, they also created music according to him, and called this the music of the spheres. This idea may not have been scientifically correct, but it inspired generations of scientists, especially the astronomer Johannes Kepler, who searched for this music of the spheres, and in the process, discovered his laws of planetary motion. Following scientists found other connections between mathematics and nature. So Pythagoras helped to give birth to mathematics as a science that explains the universe around us.